Hello everyone, Sigmalator here, and welcome back to my channel. Uh, I came back briefly, but still wasn't ready to come back due to burnout, so, but I'm back again because the Resident Evil Welcome to Raccoon City trailer has just dropped. As you may or may not know, I am a huge Resident Evil fan. In fact, in the run-up to Village, I played through all of the mainline entry titles, including both Revelations titles. Uh, you can find a playlist to that down in the description if you want to check it out, please do. But for now, let's check out this new trailer. I mean, I'm kind of in two minds about this film. But hopefully this trailer can put some of my concerns to rest. Let's go. Every story has a beginning. It sure does. Oh, hunk. Discover the hey, Claire. of evil. Why are you back here, Claire? Your conspiracies weren't true when we were kids. They're not true now. We need to expose Umbrella. Watch this. I'm afraid, Claire. I'm afraid of what they're going to do to this town. You see, Umbrella, they have an incident. I'm talking Chernobyl, if you know what I mean. People are getting sick. Ooh. You gotta help us, Claire. Let the world know what's really going on. Okay. Oh, you're fucked. We have to contain this. Shall we go? Okay. Whoa! Was that? Was that the Ashfords? This is where they're experimenting on him. We should split up. Okay. Oh shit! It's the actual mansion. All right, that's that's new. What the? Itchy tasty. We gotta get out of here. All right, CGI is a little rough on the dog, but. Oh, Birkin. Lickers. Okay, let's uh, mute that and run that back. Well, okay, initial impressions, pretty good, actually. They've definitely taken, taken some liberties with the story. But, um, but this scene here, I'm not quite understand, I don't quite understand why Chris is being dismissive of Claire unless He's doing that deliberately because we know Kristen in the games, Chris went to Europe without telling Claire because he didn't want her getting involved with Umbrella. So I'm guessing that scene probably takes place after his in his part of the film in the Spencer Mansion. So he's trying to protect her here. That's my theory. Is that Irons? You're fucked, mate. <laughs> oh, damn. Yeah, are you are. I'm liking what I'm seeing. Claire on a bike, RPD, Chris, Claire, Leon. I know a lot of people were upset about the casting, but you know what? As long as just the characterization is right, I'm not too fussed about the looks. I mean, yeah, no, that maybe that wasn't. Oh, hang on, no, hang on. Let's go back. What did that say? Is that the Ashfords? I don't think it. Oh, it might be. They're pulling the wings of a dragonfly. Okay, so. Potentially already setting things up for a sequel, because this film, I think, covers the first two Resident Evil games. So a sequel might cover three and Co Veronica, although I'm not really sure how that would work. But I think that is the Ashfords. Let's... It is. It's the Ashfords. 
Alexa and Alfred. I love Alfred. He is a proper psycho. He's one of my favourite characters in the series. Oh god, what's happening there? Yeah, there we go. Ashford twins. All right, confirmed. They are definitely the Ashfords. Nice. And we've got some kind of dossier here or photo album of the Umbrella Corporation. Oh god, I want to. This is not normally something I do, because uh, I'm not very good at them. I'm like doing trailer breakdowns. What we've we got here? Dangerous. Oh, Lisa Trevor. Oh, you poor sweet summer child. Successfully isolates G virus. You know what? I'm excited. I don't care. I am pumped. I cannot wait to see this now. I was worried that some of the things looked cheap. I mean, the CGI doesn't look great on the dogs, I'll admit, but everything else looks amazing. Look. That. Already far more faithful to the, to the movies, to the games rather, than the Anderson efforts that will just pretend they never happened. This bit's interesting. Why is a helicopter crashing into the Spencer Mansion? Unless they're killing off Brad here? I don't even know if Brad is in the movie. I know Richard is. Uh, we don't have Barry or Rebecca, which is disappointing. But if this is the close, if this is going to get us a step towards a much more faithful interpretation of the games into the films, I can deal with that. Oh god, that. I love it, they've recreated that moment from the first game where I wonder if that's Kenneth being eaten there. Um, I like the makeup. The makeup looks really good. Yeah, there we go, itchy tasty. Not in a diary on the window. Like it, nice reference. I'm guessing this is Lisa before she's finished mutating. We've got the zombies, Chris and Claire, Leon taking someone out there, probably uh, Ben. This might be Ben actually. Oh, I want to go. I need to have a look at that. Let's go back. Is that Burke enough after he's been shot, or just a random zombie? I don't know. Holy shit! Look at our boy. Birkin! Alright, not a completely faithful rendition, but all the elements are there. We've got the eyeballs, we've got this, this skull thing protruding out of his face. I like it. I'm, I'm liking what I'm seeing. Oh, and they've recreated this moment, looking at the ceiling and a liquor. And look at him. Look at our little pet, our little boy. They grow up so fast. But damn, it looks quite close to the remake liquor from the RE2 remake. I like it. Resident Evil, welcome to Raccoon City. Yep, yeah, I'm excited. Definitely going to go and see this. Very happy. A couple of issues, but I don't think there will be too much of a problem once we see the whole thing in context. But I'm very happy. Really looking forward to this. Catch you next time, guys.